welcome back to Rich and Bella Crafts. Rich are here, hope you're all well. So for today's video, you will need some small little paper bags. Now, if you don't have any paper bags, that's fine. You can just mix them up out of some thin printer paper. That'll do the job quite nicely. Or even if you've got some vellum, you could make one up out of vellum. They're really not difficult to make. It's actually a half fold and then a bottom fold. And then if you want to tape at the top. But these are a really nice addition either to use as uh, little pockets in your journal or if you would like to give somebody some happy mail. Now, I do apologize for my video not coming up yesterday. I was actually um, up until about half past four <laughs> doing the little welcome packs for uh, the retreat. And I actually covered um, about 28 um, brown paper bags yesterday to use for my happy mail gifts. Um, so whilst I'm in the mood of that, I thought, I know I'm going to do them with you guys today. So you're going to need your scrap bins. Grab them now, ladies and gents. You should now by now have lots of leftover bits. I know I'm going to have a little go with some of the bits I got left over from the kit this morning. Um, like I say, a paper bag. And then I just got some scrap bits here then of material, a little bit of lace. And I've also got um, some, oh, I can never remember what this is called, embossed paper. Okay, so let's make a start. And it's nothing complicated. We are literally just going to pick out a few bits and pieces that we really like the look of and then collage basically onto the bag. Now, I absolutely love this page here. Um, and I'm going to use my curly ruler this morning to just give me a nice edge. In fact, do you know what? I think I'm going to use her instead. So let's just go around like that because I think she'll be rather striking there on my page. So I do hope you're all well. I do hope you're all enjoying the collaboration. Now, today is... I'm just having a quick look, trying to remember what day of the week it is. I think it's Thursday. No, it's not. It's Friday. It's Friday today. I think I've lost a day. So we have got today... Rhonda from Junk Joy Junk Teak. Joy Junk Teak? Yes, that's right, isn't it? So please make sure you go and check out her channel. Um, yesterday we had the lovely Cara Renee. Um, oh my goodness, I absolutely loved her video. She was fabulous. Um, and I just so enjoyed listening to her chatting. So she, she was an absolute pleasure for company yesterday, and I really, really enjoyed her video. So thank you for that, Cara Renee. It's lovely to have you on the team. Um, we've had a brilliant week, haven't we, with the collab? Absolutely brilliant. I'm just checking my my scripture now before I commit to a piece of book page. <laughs> we don't want a repeat of last week, do we? No, that was horrifying. Definitely don't want that happening again. Oh, my goodness gracious me. Look at the music paper I want here now. Right, all these are not... Oh, gosh, that is one piece. So that feels really thick. Right, let's just give that a bit of a nicer edge. That's it. And then it doesn't overly matter that they're not straight because you won't see them all. So I'm just creating a bit of a back background thing here. Um, but we've had lots of kind of like quite meaty projects, haven't we, with the collab. So I thought um, so we might appreciate something simple from me today. Um, a quick and easy. And also, you know, some fillers now to get those journals filled up. Because I do hope that you've been crafting along. Um I have not completed any of my uh, boho journals yet. I've got like, I think I've got three on the go now. Um, so my task uh, this week, while I'm uh, next week while I'm at the uh, retreat, um, will be to complete my boho journal. So I've said it here now, guys. So those of you that are going to be there with me, you can hold me to task. I need to get some journals finished. I literally haven't finished a journal for ages, like ages. Um, so they're just all like lining up behind me now in boxes and it's ridiculous. So I need to get some jobs completed. Life has just been so crazy um, and I just need to get off the treadmill for five minutes and catch my breath. I've actually had quite a productive morning. I have my dining room. Uh, well, I don't know why I've ever referred to it as a dining room. It's n it doesn't resemble a dining room in any way, shape or form. It used to be my craft room. Um, and then I moved up here and it just all got a bit crazy downstairs and now it's like just a, a dumping ground room and it, it's you, you literally have to walk through the room to get anywhere else in the house you know to get to the kitchen to the back door you have to walk through this room there's no door on it either so i can't even just shut the door and forget about it so every day i go downstairs and look at it oh that blue stuck along there and it makes me miserable <laughs> so this morning i actually got up and started tackling it i tell you what it felt blinking great so I feel very pleased with myself. I mean, it's, it's a work in progress. I haven't finished. I just thought, oh, I better just nip up and do my 
video while everybody's out and is quiet um, before the crazy starts again. But I intend to go down and finish it off this afternoon because I want to go away next week and come home knowing that dining room is tidy. Because that'll just make my week that well. It'll just be like, oh, isn't, you know, there's nothing worse than going out away somewhere and staying somewhere really nice and then thinking, oh, God, i got to go home now. My house is a tip. So I know you can all relate. Um, I am not a tidy, tidy person by nature. I am just, I don't know, I just find it quite overwhelming on times. But um, yes, it feels good to tackle that. There's already a humongous box of stuff ready to be gotten rid of. So I'm very pleased with myself there. I'm just wondering whether I'm just layering the fabric up here now. Um, I don't like that hard bit there. I'm gonna, I'll keep it because obviously it'll come in use for something else, of course. I tell you what, the mind I have chucked out some stuff this morning. Oh my word, things I've kept since I started, like card and packaging, and, and I was looking, thinking, Rich, you haven't used it in the three and a half years you've been junk journaling. You're not gonna use it now. Chuck it out. Just, just. Truck it out, so I've been really brutal. The band aid has been ripped off today, I tell you. But it does feel good. It feels really good. I've got a terrible heartburn this morning. Mine probably got something to do with that. I only had three hours sleep, but there we are. But never mind. I can hear the dog moving around downstairs now. I wonder what she's up to. <laughs> right, sorry, I'm mumbling now because I'm thinking and I'm chatting. I think I'm going to put that there, maybe, or. There, or shall I trim it down? We'll put it in sections. Yes, that looks good. There we go. So we'll pop that on there like so. So I don't know if you saw my post yesterday, but I'm super, super excited because I'm almost, almost at 17,000 subscribers. So just wanted to say a huge, massive thank you to everybody. Thank you to you all for your amazing continued support because um, it does mean the absolute world. And it's so encouraging. Um, and if you do watch and you haven't yet logged in and subscribed, if you wouldn't mind thinking about doing that, that would be lovely. I really appreciate it. Um, and. If you want to leave a like or a comment on my video, that would be great too. It's always nice to know who's out there watching. Right, let's try and do something with the shape of this. Tell me what you've been up to, what you like best about the collab. Oh, not best, I don't like asking that question. What you liked this year about the collab. And you can say everything, but it's a bit of a cop out. So tell me some of the things you've really enjoyed. Tell me the videos that really inspired you. Good to have feedback. Because I've got a plan the next one now. I'll be doing that when I'm away too. I've got digital creators block at the minute, so <laughs> I haven't done my kit yet for next month. <laughs> I don't know, I'm going to have to factor some sleep in somewhere, but I can't see it happening anytime soon. I have to be honest. I um, what, What's the date? Oh, it's the 23rd. Oh, we're all right. We're all right. I've got, I've got a couple of days. Like, I'm gonna have to like knock something out of the park now because it's like I want to put this on here, but I don't know where. Where to put, just put a little snippet somewhere. I don't know. Mm. Or maybe I'll put this bit on here. What are we thinking? Yeah, it's a bit bitty in there. I don't really like that. There's something bugging me about this. I wonder if I put that on there to join the two. Yes, that's better. That was irritating me. There we go. So there's lots of things you can use to decorate your bag. So I say I'm just using bits of lace and fabric scraps. Um, I just had a thought there. I hope I haven't stuck it down to itself. But I haven't, no. Um, buttons. That's another nice um, thing that you can use. Now, I've got this snippet here that I did ooh, ages and ages ago. This was like a part of an autumn journal I did, I think, like almost two years ago now. Um, but I just thought, actually, I might snip a bit off the end of that because that might be quite nice and then maybe it's just to suit the right colours isn't it perhaps we pop that down there or make a cluster it up by there or pop it over here and add it over the top I don't know no, down there I think because that's annoying me that bit there and then I'm going to pop some buttons on here then I think and I think that'll finish it off quite nicely um, amazing, by the way, I have to say, to see the response to um, 
Tina Chabby Dabby Doodah's video the other day. Uh, you guys are amazing. Um, I saw her Kofi page um, this morning and it absolutely astounding response. So you, you're just absolutely wonderful. F fabulous community that we've got and I'm just really proud of you all and I'm really proud to be part of it. Part of, um, you know, just such a caring um, and responsive community. I mean, she is going through such a horrendous time um and to see everybody rally around her like they have has just been so oh my gosh it's just been wonderful so um yeah that's just, that's just you know brilliant job guys on your part there um and just lovely to see everybody you know respond to the kind of call um and i hope that she's doing okay and i hope everything went well for her um we just got to keep looking after everybody, haven't we? Tough times. Tough times for lots of people. Definitely. Right. Let's put some of these little charms on here. I think that might actually be better than the buttons. Because it is boho. Oh, you're going to stick now. Anything else? No wriggling around. Let's pop that one on there. Oop. That wasn't quite what I was aiming for, but okay. That'll have to do. My glue does dry transparently, thankfully. Um, let's pop that one there, maybe. I'm not putting a huge amount of thought into this. I hope it doesn't look like... <laughs> does it look awful? I hope it doesn't. I've got like 60,000 things going on in my head right now. And, and what I'm actually doing in front of me is not one of them. <laughs> Sorry. Um, yeah. Oh my god, I'm really hot, I am. Really hot. I don't know why I've been hot all week. My mess doesn't do it. <laughs> oh dear. Right, there we go. That's the three hours sleep starting to kick in. Or lack of sleep, I should say. Right, there we are. I think that looks quite good. I think it's really like eclectic. That's boho, isn't it? And I can be able to put loads of things in there now in my journal. I like that. I like that very much. I'm not going to do any more to it. I could do heaps more. I could put lace all around the outside. I could do all sorts of things. But I'm not going to. I like it like that. And I'm going to leave it like that. And I've just got my fake page here a minute. Oh, that's a pretty shimmery one, isn't it? And it does. It just fits nicely on there. So there you go, guys. That's your little challenge for today. Go and decorate yourselves a paper bag either for a pocket in your journal or to send somebody some happy mail. Either one is entirely up to you. Um, but please don't forget to um, put a picture up onto the group if you are crafting along with 100 days. We're almost there. And also um, put the uh, hashtag 100 days rab, R-A-B, which stands for Rachel and Bella, for those of you that were a bit confused before. Um, and don't forget now, tomorrow you have got two collaboration videos. Uh, you've got Nancy and Terry. Yes, sorry, I was getting confused then looking at next week. It's because Bella was telling me what she was doing and it threw me there then. Right, yes, we have. Gosh, of course, we've got another week, haven't we? Oh, my goodness. Right, and then you'll have me Sunday. Just hope I don't forget. Because <laughs> I'm off to London Sunday, but I will tell you more about that tomorrow. Right, have a great day, everybody, and I will be back with you very soon. Take care now. Bye-bye.